In this video I'll show you how to import music from PDF files. PDF are one of the most common ways in which music is distributed and you can put your music into Power Music from PDF files. So let's just go and start a new song. This launches the song editor and we go to the second tab here which is a PDF tab and we can open a PDF. So we'll just click on here and we'll browse to some public domain PDFs I've downloaded here. So we'll just choose the first one and open it up. And this is a PDF of Farrelly's. It's got five pages. I can look at each page in turn or I can simply select all of the pages and say add the selection into Power Music. And as I do that, you'll notice the pages get added along the bottom. So there's the five pages. One, two, three, four, five pages. All I need to do now to save this is to give it a title. So I go to title, add a title. Say OK to that. I can also put in all the other details we discussed in the overview video. We can put in authors and categories and uh, references and audio links and all of that. But all I need to do to save it is give it a title. I should also select number of pages per screen. So I want it in two pages per screen. I can preview that quickly by looking there. And then I just click save. And that's it saved. So putting in a piece of music from PDF is as simple as that. But of course you can do much more than that. So if we go back to new song. And again, we go to PDF. Let's look at what the settings are. Now, one of the things that we do in PDF is we extract the music from PDF at a particular resolution. And that resolution defaults to 150 dots per inch, which is perfectly adequate for an HD screen. However, if you want to then cut up that music into smaller parts, you might want to take it in at a higher resolution so that when you cut out parts of the music, expand it up on the screen, it's still quite good quality. You can also switch between grayscale and color input, but bear in mind if you import from color, then the file size will be significantly larger and it may well slow down the page turning. So other things like grayscale softening, which can change the uh, way the music appears. If you want to experiment with these, fine. If not, just leave the default settings.